space time. Oh, what I do is I take people's ideas, break them apart, and then we rearrange them to make the best masterpiece you can. Like yes. you come with an idea, we'll work on your idea till you get the confidence and then we'll start to see what it can become. So break it down and start to build the parts that will make it better. Just a little bit, start a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, and then before you know it, you got a masterpiece. And he never rushes. Yeah, never don't rush. rush the process. I, I listen to a lot of inspirational music made by the best of the best in the world. So you build a palette, you know what sounds good. And the patience and the hunger, because a mix takes a week to get done. And I could be working on a vocal part for three days. Because you know what you want it to sound like, and you just keep gunning till you get it. And closer and closer you get, closer to the finished product which is there they sound so that's yeah it's the ambition towards it that's the goal every time young dapper is a unique artist in the sense that He's almost unleashed. <laughs> the only person I can compare him to is Young Thug because I'd read a lot about the way Young Thug's producer worked in his story. Mm. And Young Thug just steps up to the mic and just goes. Which is incredible because it's almost like you're freestyling. But in that freestyle, that's where you capture the moments. And this dude's full of moments. Like, full of golden moments that you cannot create, you can't plan it. It's just natural. And that's what makes this guy the greatest addict is he just rocks up and gets it done. Oh, it's unique and it's powerful. His voice is huge. Got that from my dad for sure. <laughs> his voice is massive and his, his presence is massive, which is what sets him apart without a doubt on any stage. Can step back, yeah, now I put it in it Thinking about the bigger picture, thinking about the impact that I had on the girl That I love and I feel it, yeah, I feel it love And I admit that I play my fire I should have seen the bigger picture from the start But I didn't, now that you were gone Yeah, I see it, now that you were gone I help each artist identify themselves first because you have to have a reference. You come in, I want to sound like Jay-Z, I want to sound like Ariana Grande. That's great. We'll start on that path, but I also like to shine the light on the individual. Like, this is your talent, this is what you can bring, which could be better than what other people, like, that you look enough to can bring. And so that builds their confidence and that helps the performance just be even greater. And freestyle, I found with us, you and me, and the way we work together, Freestyling really, really brought that out because it put me into like not having to like try and like read what I'm writing. I'm like read what I'm singing. I'm just literally going for it, and there's a lot more motion in it and yeah. stuff. And that helped me find my own voice by jumping into that. Uh, it's not an artist. I'd really love to hear a symphony. Sounds crazy, but I would love to be in the studio watching oh, um, the greats record a symphony. Yeah, that, that's my bucket list. So much, like so many different dynamics, every instrument mixing all at once. Like, yeah, that's insane. I, I, I could do that. That would be wild. Um, perfectionist. Um, I'm absolute perfectionist when it comes to like, and I'm very hard sometimes to work with because I'm just so straightforward and intense. So like, somebody, you know, I look, I, I, I was looking for somebody who could get that sound that I wanted and be able to capture it and make it to a sound how I've envisioned it basically. And Farai is literally the only person straight up that was just like, yep, no worries. And then Borman was able to like do that. And yeah, he's 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 not just sitting there 
randomly pressing buttons and recording and going, that's it. He goes, no, he goes, I want you to do this. You need to do this more, you need to do this more. And he makes me do it again and again and again until we get it perfect. And that's why the sound and the music does sound like very high quality because it is high quality because it's been finely tuned. Very melody driven, it's melodic, but it's also very powerful. Um, Travelling into some of the more like up tempo songs, it's um, very, very driving. But yeah, it's very, very melodic kind of people. A lot of people some, sometimes say post Malone, and that's all cool. Like, I love that. But yeah, definitely Young Thug. You know, that like kind of random squeaky noises, that all that sort of stuff, it all just builds. So yeah, my sound's very melodic, kind of like spacey, trippy. With what else? What do you, what do you reckon? That's it. Yeah. Definitely melodic. Yeah. And catchy. Catchy, it's very true, it's yeah. Real catchy. Mm. I love I love stuff that people can kind of just get in their head and get stuck with you fucking on a rag. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> We've been recording a Brazilian funk song tonight. It's pretty crazy. Like for the first time, like we always say we dive in deep. I'm singing in uh, Portuguese. Don't know what I'm singing, I've learned it now. Um, but you're killing it. Yeah, it was good. Bringing the vibe, bringing the energy. It's a great summer song. Yeah. It's a great summer song. And it's going to be catchy as ever. Looking forward to shooting the video. Because mm. that's going to be... <laughs> that's going to be next level. It's crazy. It's Just to imagine a whole heap of Brazilian girls dancing. Beautiful. You know, it's crazy like with what we do with our work. Where we, we often like... You can be so busy doing different things. But we like to be busy doing the right things. And this track, for one, like is... An amazing opportunity that we've got and so that's why we're doing it right and taking the time and singing Portuguese you know and actually mixing it up though like we test ourselves we push ourselves in the studio to do stuff that we haven't experienced before to then give a song to people that they haven't experienced before so it's pretty crazy but yeah this song keep an eye out it's gonna be huge in Brazil I'm gonna make it go viral